Um, I, I, not not one person. So I'd say my brother, my sister, and then my husband in, in more recent years. But brother and sister, because we had an incredibly chaotic home life. I left home at 15, my brother joined the RAF um, to get away, and my sister had a baby at 15, and it's kind of a bonding experience, and we've got an amazing relationship with my mum and dad. Um, but yeah, we both we all look at each other every now and then and go, yeah, we're doing all right, given what's happened, so that's good. And my husband, he genuinely impresses me every day. He winds me up every day, because he leaves things out, outside of an empty uh, a dishwasher and stuff like that. But he is um, he's an amazing person, brilliantly brained, and a brilliant dad. Ah, can it be like quite difficult to achieve? I would love to dance with a Strictly Pro. There's just I, I just I just love that program. Glitter sequins. I just takes you out of yourself. Um, I think uh, yeah. I used to dance when I was a kid, so it would be brilliant to do something like that. <sighs> My Yorkshire granddad used to say, "Shy kids don't get sweets," and I think. Given, regardless of the job I do, which is quite out there, I'm actually quite a quiet person, quite a private person. So just that reminder that you have to put yourself forward and go and ask stuff. And I try and tell school kids when I meet them that. Uh, I've got loads of worst qualities. My team will tell you it's because I amend uh, letters and documents constantly and I'm quite exacting and I panic when things go out wrong. So uh, that's, that's not a great quality. I always get quite ratty without exercise. Best qualities, um, uh, a lawyer that used to work for me, she said that she's never met anybody before that is more fascinated by humans. And I, I think that is probably right. Um, Ah, just, oh, well, I mean, there's just so much countryside, quirkiness, and I think just the fact that they took a bit of a punt on me and gave us the first female MP for a generation. <laughs>